we need to take drastic steps now. Eric Haldeman is the former top boss of the King County Office of Emergency Management with 36 years of experience directing emergency responses for thousands of people. He used to think a major earthquake would be the big one, but now he says it's the coronavirus and to combat it, we need a bolder response. Do you think we're at the point where we have to have a higher level of public safety direction? I do. I think we need to put the hammer down nationally. I call it lock it up. You know, let's get everybody into isolation, quarantine, whatever you want to call it. Haldeman says he's been tracking the devastation in Italy, where the death toll has surpassed China's at nearly 3,500 lives lost. That's why he says we need a national shelter in place, similar to what they've done in China. If the federal government does not take the steps that, that you're talking about, do you think the state should go for it? I do. The earlier you take action, uh, the better you are. We're being so reactive to it, we need to be proactive. And there's some good things that have been done, but the, the big emergency coming is for the medical community. Again, Haldeman points to Italy, where the healthcare system is collapsing with a lack of beds, supplies, and healthcare workers as they've gotten sick. I think we're at four now. And we're rapidly going to move to 10. In a couple weeks, at the maximum, we'll be at 10 from a medical community response. The behavior of thousands of young people vacationing, socializing in big groups, and ignoring the advice of experts is a big reason Haldeman thinks stricter mandates should be put in place. That action has to stop. That's just totally disrespectful of the health of the overall community, because that's only going to prolong the spread and... In fact, some of them will get sick and can become very ill. Of course, we don't want to panic people, but I feel like you're just being, you're taking decades of experience and, and looking at the facts and just saying, this is what we can do to help ourselves. Absolutely. I mean, again, uh, the earlier we put the hammer down, I think the better it will be for everyone long term. And Haldeman could not stress enough the importance of doing our part to help the medical providers. He warns the crisis will reach a catastrophic level in two to three weeks for hospitals and clinics, especially if we don't do more. I'm Susanna Frame in the newsroom. Susanna, thank you.